Okay, we've got some packages that came in today. Let's take a look at what they are. I've blacked out all the addresses except one, and that one I'm going to open up first and upside down. So let's see what we can do here. All right, most of these are going to be purchases that I've made here recently. And this one came inside an invoice, so we'll slide, take this up, out of shot. And this is a Copper Round World of Dragon series. The Egyptian, it's the last one I needed to complete my Copper Rounds for the Egyptian series. As you can see, this is a good looking Copper Round. There's the eye on the back. Now, copper rounds aren't very valuable, but they are fun to collect. It gives you an opportunity for an expensive price to get a lot of different uh, uh, rounds with different designs on them. Okay, this was bought from uh, Barb Shoe. Barb Shoe. That's her eBay store. Good looking store. Got it very quick. She'll be getting positive feedback. Oh, all right. Next, we'll do. Uh, let's do this one. This one's from from one of the local, from one of the guys that we all deal with. This is Man Beer. I bought some pennies from his his store. I'll be doing a. Uh, what I got out of here? These are supposed to all be BU pennies. And give me one second. I'm gonna go grab a knife because this is very well uh, taken care of. One second. Okay, I'm back. See what I brought my my little shred with me. Let's see what I can do with this. Don't laugh at me. I'm trying to do this with my neck muscles. All both of them. Fail. All right, let me try. I had to put a little slit in it with the shred. Now I'm gonna try to get it, what's in here out. And there's the invoice, and I'll hang on to that. It probably has addresses and such on there. Oh, and he sent a nice roll of pennies and a penny roll. These are supposed to be BU pennies. Oh, well, they look pretty good from... At least that one does, and that one does. Can't see the dates. Well, I'll take a look. I'll get you... I'll get a, uh, a look at what he sent me. All right, this is from Manveer, Sandy Super Saiyan, Sandy Saiyan Guide. He sent me a nice little thank you. Um, I'm going to leave him some positive feedback because above and beyond all, he did get it to me in a timely fashion, and those definitely look like some, some good pennies to look for. There's some better pennies for my book. Okay, let's, let's do this small one. This feels like another copper round or another round of some sort. Let's see what I can do to get into it. I see why now everybody catches fits trying to get all this done one-handed. A tripod for my phone, evidently. Okay, here we're back. I made a nice little tear in it. I'm gonna pull out the round. Oh, nope, it's all coming out together. All right, let's pull, slide the round out. Now, forgive me if this is a round. I'll go ahead. Yep, this is another copper round. Actually, it's two copper rounds. Um, these are prospectors. I just wanted to get a look and see what the prospector line looked like So I can order some silver prospectors here in the near future um, There's let me get them out of this plastic hold on one second now These are two copper prospectors. I thought they were gonna be more similar to the Regular pos prospectors we see here Um, they still look really, really good, really nice. I was expecting more of a similar, the, the silver one, so I'll have to look at the silver one, but if they're set up like this, I'd probably start getting some silver prospectors as well. Okay, I'm going to open up the next package and be right back. Okay, we have here our 10 penny roll, tip, keeper rolls. I got these, I've been buying a lot of wheat pennies and having some left over after I run the roll, so I'm going to go ahead and put them all in here. Uh, when they're done and go ahead and uh, keep them until I'm ready to get rid of them but they'll be in a nice airtight or nice 
might not be airtight, but wa definitely watertight uh, jar, uh, container that I can stack up pretty easy. And as you can see, it says penny right on the top. I bought 10 of these. That was what I could get. All right, we have one last package to open today. And yes, I have my Purell out. So I clean my hands when I'm done because I don't want any beer flu as an Okay. I don't have much time left in this one, but there's two rounds in here. Okay, the backs of shield. Oh, this is a, this is the one that looks like the 1964 Kennedy. And this looks like oh, this is the Rattler. There's a shield on the back. And a rattlesnake on the front. Just definitely like having different size rounds, different, not size, but different types of rounds around. So this one right here, like I said, finished all my, finished up my, my copper, finished up my drag, copper dragons. This one is a rattlesnake one. John F. Kennedy set and a couple. And that's a couple of coppers. These are prospector, copper prospectors. Stack. This is a roll full of pennies. And that's what I got today. And then of course I got the other style of penny, penny rolls as well. So looking at these. First one looks really, really shiny and really, really good. And that is a 1963D. Let's see if I can get it to read. There we go. 1963D. Trying to get it to mind my bad camera work, guys. I'm trying. It's definitely 1963D. It doesn't look too bad. A couple little dings on it, but it's definitely a BU. All right. Thank you very much. And uh, these pennies will be in another one where I do some penny roll hunts here shortly. But I just wanted you to see one. Okay, thanks very much. Peace, dollar out.